Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to download and install an application on the Galaxy S4 Mini. Now the Galaxy S4 Mini comes with two application stores out of the box. We've got the standard Google Play Store which should be on almost every Android device and Samsung Apps which is specific to newer Samsung devices and contains some Samsung specific applications which you can't get anywhere else. Um, both of these require an account. The Play Store requires a Google account, Samsung App Store a Samsung account, which can be set up on the device, either in the initial installation period or manually afterwards. I am going to use the Play Store, because I've already signed in uh, with a Google account, and you can use the Play Store, this is what the front end looks like, uh, you can search for any applications that you like, I am going to search for the Facebook application because the actual Android app isn't pre-installed on this device. Uh, just press the install button. A bunch of app permissions will appear. This is everything that the application requires of the device. Um, it's worth taking a read through some of these just to see what certain applications do. Um, sometimes spurious apps will be asking to do things with your device that uh, you don't think they should be. Facebook requires quite a lot of permissions because it's a very intensive application. If I press accept to that, instantly you'll see it downloading. Uh, I'm using a Wi-Fi connection here. You can see that total amount of 16.63 megabytes. Uh, it's just going to take a few more seconds to download the application. Uh, and you can see up here in the notification bar that the download is occurring. If I scroll down we'll get another confirmation of the percentage that we are through that download. And as soon as it finishes downloading, that will update to tell me that it's installing, um, which it will be doing in the background. The whole process is automatic after you accept it. It will just start downloading. You could have pressed that little X in the corner to get rid of it. Now it's installing. Uh, that'll take another moment or two. And you see we've still got the uh, notification here and now successfully installed. So if I go onto a home screen, I should see a Facebook icon appear. Um, and for every application which is downloaded and installed, uh, an icon will appear in the apps menu, which you can access from here, apps on the home screen. And a shortcut is generally added to the home screen as well. And then you can simply launch your new application by tapping and it will open up and do what you need to do. That's how I download and install my app. Thanks for watching.